We should get there tomorrow. I told you before, Sam. The past just won't let go. Listen, I have something to ask of you. It has to do with that asshole. Do you remember? It's almost time to go, Sam. I had no idea until you told me. No idea that I was alive. Living is no different from being dead if you're all alone. I don't want to go home. Here. It's a dream catcher. Wear it when you sleep, and I'll keep the nightmares away. I'll always be with you. Did you forget how to go home? Come on. I'll take you halfway. And then you can do the rest by yourself. Better now? I'll be waiting for you on the beach. Come and find me. We used to play together a lot in this place. You brought me here. I couldn't make the trip on my own. So long as you have a body to return to, you can't come and go as you please. So you can't just come back east through here? Not until you make us whole again, Sam. I'll be waiting for you, on the beach. Come and find me. I 
don't know how you sleep. Need a pick me up? Hmm. Welcome to Lake Knot City. What? Nothing. Let's go. This cargo is from Port Knot City, bound for Lake Knot. I'll leave these up to you. The dispatch terminal is up ahead. In the meantime, I've got some business to attend to. Later, alligator.
Stay safe. Good work. Sorry for the hassle. Can't be too careful these days. Oh, we heard you were carrying a Cupid. Is that right? You're clear to lick us up. So we're finally on the network. Long time coming. We won't hold anything back. Capital Not Studio will get everything. If all this info sharing makes everyone safer, I'm all for it. You can bet I'm not the only one here who feels that way. I suppose it was better when Bridges One first came this way. At least I don't remember terrorists and BTs making our lives difficult back then. Well, be careful out there. The world's not what it used to be. And thank you. Finally made it past ground zero, Sam. Congratulations. And thank you. It'll only get harder from here, though. When we first came through, it was different. Peaceful. The three cities out there, Blake, Middle, and South Knot, were all on board with our plans for reconstruction. Fragile Express was contracted by all three and kept supplies moving and people connected. But that all changed a year ago. When the Separatists carried out their attacks, one took out Middle Knot City. They detonated nukes from the old days. Half of South Knot City went up in the other. Casualties were devastating. Bridges doesn't have the resources to link up the remaining cities on its own. We need to secure the support of everyone, even those who want nothing to do with the UCA. Impossible as that may seem. The situation has changed dramatically since Bridges One first went west. The destruction of Middle Nod in particular forced us to adapt a new strategy. It's like Amelie said, we don't have the time or resources to construct another knot on that scale. That's why we've taken to cutting deals with preppers and the like. Our only recourse is to utilize their shelters to bolster the strength of the network. It takes a special kind of person to live out here on their own. The kind that'll tell us to fuck off if we ask him to join the UCA. Oh, we know. No one's expecting them to say yes up front. But even if they don't like dealing with most people, they got on okay with Fragile Express. Don't tell me. You want us to use her credentials to get in good with them? Bingo. She's agreed to it, too. And in exchange, she gets... Nothing, really. A chance to get back at Higgs, I suppose? I can't blame her for warning one. He took everything from her and then some. Time healed some wounds, but not hers. The work ahead won't be simple or easy, but it needs doing. Get some rest for now. 
We'll talk more later. Your work is great. For me? It's called a key proof. It means not in old words. You can also use it to count stuff. I add a knot when I make a friend. Okay. Then how about I add another knot every time I see you? This must be very important to you if you were able to bring it here. Very special. It is special. I made it for you. I'll treasure it, Sam. Something to eat? Why are you here? Ask your boss man. No. I mean, why are you here? Got a delivery for a porter. You're gonna need this on the road ahead. This will ID you as an associate of Fragile Express. It's woven from my blood and chiral crystals. Think of it as a kind of bond. Preppers around these parts won't give you trouble so long as you've got it. We were the only people making deliveries out here. This was our territory. Until Higgs fucked it all up. Me, the Express, our reputation, all of it. And now you want to fuck him back? On your own? I'm not on my own. The cave, Port Not City, next to your bed. So far apart, yet somehow we keep meeting. All that BT country in between where I should have been caught in a void out. Yet here I am. Here I am. You can use the beach? I have a beach. You've got yours. I've got mine. I use it to jump across space. I can't conjure up BTs the way Heeks can. But I can go after him. Chase him to the beach. Problem is, everyone's got their own way in. I'm only allowed to pass through the beach I know and understand. I'm sure you've heard the term multiverse. You all right? The jumps take a lot out of me. Suck my blood dry. You're going to Edgenaut City, right? Place is full of terrorists. But if you're dead set on it, then you're gonna have to deal with heat sooner or later. Look, I make deliveries, killing monsters and terrorists. It's not what I do. What if we did it together? I could use my power to help you. We don't have to want the same thing to be on the same side. I could send you across my beach to any place the Kyrelians think enough, any place connected to the Chiral network. And what do you expect in return? I expect you to think it over. Here. Call it an incentive. And call me if you need me. This will keep us connected. See you when I see you.
Sam, access the Lake Knot City delivery terminal. Sam, to review. Your present objective is to extend the Cairo network from Lake Knot City to South Knot City. To that end, you'll need to utilize prepper shelters as way stations. Frankly, it won't be easy. Fragile's tried to get some of them on board, but you know how preppers are. More than a few won't want anything to do with the UCA. So we've got to prove to them they're better off with us. Figure out what they need and what we can provide, and then deliver. Do that, and they just might agree to join us. All right, get to it. The list of orders is on the terminal. Your destination is a shelter south of Lake Knot City. The package you're carrying contains a network-ready Evo Devil unit, a special device that applies the principles of evolutionary biology to practical problems. When used in conjunction with a Cairo printer, it can recreate items from incomplete structural data. It's a prototype, but so far our trials have been successful. The client is a civilian, we call him the engineer, who's agreed to put the unit through validation testing for us. Be careful. The EDU is a delicate piece of equipment that must be handled with care. If you don't, it can and will break. Oh, and the engineer is second gen, born in the shelter. Not so good with people, but he's a whiz with machines. Or so I hear. The client is a first gen prepper. Old school. Been in and out of shelter since before the Death Stranding. Deliveries of his medication have fallen behind, though, and he's about to run out. There's just one case you need to bring, but there are multiple packs inside. Every dose counts, so you'd best handle it with care. While the client's life isn't in immediate danger, he's probably having a rough time. Don't keep him waiting, huh? You'll be handing this one off to a guy we call the Craftsman. Repairs, modifications, you name it, he can do it. Makes weapons, too. Nothing lethal on account of his pacifism. In fact, if you give him something lethal, he'll turn it into something that isn't. A tool designed purely for self-defense. That's what the gun parts listed in the order are for. Make sure they get to him and no one else. Guns make bodies, and bodies make craters. While you're at it, I'd also like you to transport some blood bags and hematic grenades. You know, the ones you field tested against BTs and delivered to Lake Knot City. He'd like to dole them out to the local porters. We've got no reason to keep them to ourselves, so I figured we may as well oblige him. An empty container tagged with a fake ID, AKA decoy cargo. Could be useful for fooling folks who can't get enough of other people's deliveries. Territory. 
Move fast and quiet. Because if they see you, if they catch you, to think that their parents were porters like you who risked life and limb to try and keep our country together. And now their broken children carry on the work without any understanding of what it once meant. It's a ritual to them. The delivery. An insatiable addiction. And they'll be coming for you to get their next fix. Have a pleasant journey. Restrictions lifted. Over here! Over here. Over here.
Scan. Scanning Bridges ID. Fragile Express ID verified. All weapons will remain locked until departure. Cargo verified. Thank you. Delivering cargo. Thanks. Sam Bridges, I presume? I've heard of you. The man trekking across the country trying to reconnect folks. I appreciate you bringing me this. I do. Times have been tough without Fragile Express to handle deliveries. Now let me just check the cargo. Huh. Wow. You took really good care of this. I'll let Bridges know how the V&V &V testing goes. Thanks again. you to understand something. It's about Fragile. You might have heard she helped terrorists, that she didn't care who got hurt. But I'm telling you, that's gotta be bullshit. Her and her people put their lives on the line to get us what we needed. She's a hero through and through. Look, I was born in a shelter. The only world I've ever known is within these walls. So when people talk about America, I can't even begin to imagine it. But if that Cupid connects me to everyone else, I won't have to. So yeah, I want to join the UCA. I want to see what I've been missing. My standalone 3D printer is capable of chiral printing. Assuming it works, the Evo Devo unit should enable me to replicate all kinds of archived objects. We can rebuild America one piece at a time. In the meantime, I can use the network to see what's going on in the cities. Track mule and terrorist activity. It's like you brought me the whole wide world in that package. Thank you, Sam. Let's do business again. Oh, yeah. I've got a little something I'd like you to put through its paces. An assist unit I developed myself. Works perfectly in sim trials, but I need someone to test it out on solid ground. And if it makes your job a little easier, all the better. Sam, active skeletons attach to your legs and augment your physical capabilities. The one you've got there is a load-bearing AS, designed to reinforce your joints. Just wearing an AS will provide additional support, but you can also boost it to maximize its potential. Go ahead and take it for a spin. You won't be disappointed. Thank you kindly. Come around again soon. Good work. New work. Restriction. 
restrictions lifted. There we go. Delivering cargo. I've been expecting you. You are my lifeline. I've only managed to get this far thanks to porters, and you don't ask for anything in return. You have my gratitude. Let's see how's the package. Wow, this is great. Excellent job, thank you.
so you're here on behalf of Fragile Express. Please tell me you put the terrorists behind you. When Fragile, the daughter of the founder, started associating with other couriers, things started getting scary around here. Rumors say that she caused the explosion at Middle Knot City, and there's a part of me that believes it. Of course, she could be just another one of their victims. Are you connecting the Cairo network? I don't mind a contract with Bridges, but I'm not going to join the UCA. Go ahead if you're fine with that. Maybe you already heard it from Fragile, but preppers who don't want to be a part of the UCA can still sign a contract with Bridges to join the network. They get to use our delivery services and other basic Cairo network infrastructure, much like our full members. Similarly, you'll be able to use their Cairo printing facilities to replenish your supplies. They are not, however, obligated to exchange data with us. So don't expect them to share intel or help with the development of new tech. In an ideal world, everyone would be a part of the UCA, of course. But failing that, we want everyone to at least be a part of the network. They can always change their minds after the fact. The Cupid will interface differently with the terminal depending on the type of contract. So connect your Cupid to confirm. It just got too big. In times like these, we should all keep it close and tight. That goes for couriers, too. Otherwise, we'll just make the same mistakes. Republics, federations, coalitions, states. Connecting all kinds of people together. It's just asking for trouble. Sorry. It's been a while since I last talked to anyone. Travel safe. See you around, then. Good work. New order available. Please access delivery terminal for further information. Good job, Sam. That's two prepper way stations integrated into the Cairo network. Just one more left. Weapons restrictions lifted.
Keep it up, keep it up. Delivering cargo. You're not with Fragile Express, are you? Oh, I get it. Bridget is using their IDs to complete the delivery. Well, good work, son. I'll take that off your hands. Package looks... Brand new. Wow. It's been a while since I've seen cargo in such good shape. Thank you kindly. What's your angle anyway? Everyone knows Fragile was behind the attack that wiped out Middlemont City. Only a damn fool trusts that terrorist to deliver shit now. But here you are, filling in. Keeping her business alive for her, am I right? <laughs> I swear it. Can't trust anyone these days. And don't try sweet-talking me onto your little network. You know why there's been so many terrorist attacks recently? Because you all pissed them off with your talk of reuniting the country. Join the ECA. I may as well paint a bullseye on my shelter. Just keep my deliveries coming. We'll get along just fine. I don't need any trouble. Though I will say, I appreciate these hematic grenades of yours. Quality work, gotta admit. And not the sort of equipment the UCA ought to keep to itself. There's a lot of freelance porters operating in these parts, after all. If I could churn these out by the boatload and gear up those folks, now you're good people. I can see that. And you brought my order like I asked. But it'll take more than that for me to agree to what you're asking. Cairo Network is a big step. But if you could prove to me Bridges is an organization I can trust... Hmm. What about this? Do another run for me. I'll put the details on the terminal there. Good work. New order available. Please access... Not far from Middle Knot City, you'll find the ruins of an old shopping mall. They predate the Death Stranding. The craftsmen used to live there. Until terrorists organized a void out or two and BTs started showing up. Needless to say, the craftsmen had to move house in a hurry. Grabbed what little he could and left most everything else behind. Which is where you come in. 
he wants you to go and get his old toolkit and bring it back to the shelter. His old home's locked up tight, but he'll open it remotely for you when you set out. Place is crawling with BTs, though. No one in their right mind would even try to pull this off. But if you can, then the old man might finally realize Bridges is only trying to help. The toolkit you're looking for ought to be in my old shelter. It's been tagged, so shouldn't have any trouble finding the place. I'll unlock it remotely once you get there. Oh, and take some of those hematic grenades you brought with you. Nothing you'll want more when those BTs put your back against the wall, right? Here's hoping it won't come to that. <laughs> 